Scott, not one but two families are having to pack up their lives after this fire in Lockport Sunday. It's believed to have started in a attached structure, a garage or a shed spread from what was Mark Barbaro's home on Royal Parkway North and then to Cheryl Roth's home next door. Today, Roth was allowed to go inside and salvage what she could after essentially losing half her home. Same for the Barbaros. And while investigators are still looking into what caused the fire, a South Lockport fire chief telling us the fire spread quickly. One firefighter initially responded. Two state troopers showed up to help, then another South Lockport truck and mutual aid. The chief standing by that response but said it is always a challenge given the lack of volunteers nowadays. Roth, a nursing supervisor at Suburban Hospital, telling us it's been tough to comprehend. I got here and there was the state troopers were pounding in the door and they got my dog and my birds out. Devastated. I was like, this can't be happening. This is unreal. Like to watch everything that you worked so hard for and that you built and remodeled and the memories that you can't ever get back that are just going up in flames. Depending on the time of day, and what day of the week it is. You know, we have volunteers, so everybody has jobs. So um, being on a Sunday, we had a pretty good response. Both the Roth and Barbaro families are now working through insurance. I have verified that GoFundMes have been set up for both families. We'll have those links posted on WGRZ.com. Reporting on your side in Lockport, Rob Hackford, Channel 2 News.